Here we are, lined up on runway 03, ready, go, ready to go. A few people have been in touch asking me to do a few PPL maneuvers, so today I'm going to do some practicing. I'm going to practice some force landings, uh, glide approach hopefully, and a diversion. I'm going to head down to Romney Marsh, just waiting for our takeoff clearance. Romney 03, right turn one mile, clear for takeoff VFR, surface wind light and low. Right turn one mark, clear for takeoff VFR, Golf, India Zulu. Good power, T's and P's are good, full power. Power's good, temperatures and pressures are all green. Air speed is building. Positive rate, 80 knots in the climb. T's and P's are all good. So I've got quite a lot of right rudder in to counteract the yaw from the uh, engine being on full power. First heading is uh, 117623 on the score. Started out to Victor, correct. Roof taxi on one mile. What do wrong? Golf India Zulu, basic service, report passing Seven Oaks. What level are you climbing? Basic service uh, will report passing a beam Seven Oaks, climbing to altitude 2,200 feet. Golf India Zulu. Very hazy up here. So welcome to the air everybody. Sorry it's been so long. I have been back to work because my uh, period of leave from work has ended. And so I've been getting back into the routine of going to work uh, part time albeit, but um, and looking after a child as well. So I haven't been up here in India Zulu for about a month. I have been up on a training flight recently. In fact, that was last week. Let's get a bit of air in here. So we're at Seven Oaks now. And uh, let's come down on the power a bit. Golf Eddie Zulu, Seven Oaks, 2,200 feet. We'd like to change to Farmer Radar, 123 decimal 225. Golf Eddie Zulu, Scott 7,000, frequency change approved. Frequency change approved, Scott 7,000, Golf Eddie Zulu. Oh, it's a bit warm up here. Really is warm. Let's open that vent as well. Oh, that's better. So, we have a new feature for my videos. We're going to see how this goes. The feature is the Flying Reporter's top tip of the week. Now, the top tip that I'm going to give you this week is to do with navigating in the air. What happens if you find yourself one mile off course? How do you get back on track? Well, there are a number of ways, but one easy way to do this is to say to yourself, well, basically, if I turn onto track by 30 degrees, it will take me two miles before I'm back on my course. That's basically what the maths says. So that being known, if you know it's going to take you two miles to get on course, how long will that take you? Well, if you're travelling at 120 knots, two miles will take you one minute. If you're travelling at 100 knots, as I normally do, it will take you one minute and 12 seconds. So, if you're in a Piper Warrior like this plane, you're doing 100 knots, and you're a mile off course, turn onto track by 30 degrees, hold that heading for one minute and 15 seconds, let's say, to round up, and then turn back on to your original heading. You will be on track, and then you just need to adjust your heading to allow for the drift that uh, was not right. So 
So that is my top tip of the week. I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, next time on the next video, we'll do the same again. And if you have any top tips that you've learned whilst flying, or, uh, or if perhaps you have a question and you want to know something about flying, then get in touch. You can comment on my YouTube channel, my Facebook page, or get in contact through my website. And we'll try and include some of your top tips or some of your own questions on future flights. So I hope you enjoyed that. Mid approach, Golf Charlie Echo, India Zulu, basic service. Golf Charlie Echo, India Zulu, lead approach. Good morning, pass the message. Good morning, Golf Charlie Echo, India Zulu, PA28, Biggin Hill to Biggin Hill VFR, Tenterton, 2100 feet, QH 1021. Intend to be manoeuvring at various altitudes just to the north of Rye on the uh, Romney Marsh. Request basic service. Golf India Zulu, Roger, port detail complete on the Romney Marsh. The QH is 1022, basic service, and Squawk 7066. Uh, Wilco, uh, QH 1022, basic service, Squawk 7066, Golf India Zulu. I'm just going to do a Frida check. Uh, it was 1025, so let's change fuel tanks now before we're in this position. So fuel pressure's fine, switch to the right tank. Fuel pressure's holding, fuel pump off. Pressure's holding. So yeah, I'm still a bit nervous about doing this. I hate doing practice force landings. But just have a quick look around the area. Uh, it's a bit populated there, but that's not too bad there. Got a lot of fields over there. So let's do it. Carp heat comes on. I'm going to put the fuel pump on just for safety. And here we go. So the engine has failed. So I've put it to idle. I need to trim for 75 knots. For best glide speed. I'm turning downwind. I'm looking for a field. There's one field there, which is quite good, actually. Right, there's 75 knots. That's quite good. Some other good fields there, but they've got trees over the top of them. There's some brilliant fields there. We're going to go there, I think. That's better. Uh, I've got... Uh, there's a power cable all the way over that one. But that one's not too bad. Got some bigger fields there. I'm going to pick that one there, I think. This one next to the barns. I've got an undershoot. So... Uh, fuel is on. Change tanks. Pressure's fine, but there and quantities are fine, no problem. Uh, mixture is rich, carb heat on. Let's just warm the engine. Carb heat on, trying to crank it, no joy cranking it. Mayday, mayday, mayday. Golf Charlie Echo, India Zulu, PA28 with engine failure. I'm at the Romney Marsh near the Royal Military Canal. I intend to make a force landing. There's one on board, my colour is white and blue. Okay, so we're coming up on a thousand feet. I'm gonna beam the field now. Probably a bit too close in, to be honest. So shut down checks. Uh, mixture would be to lean master off. Throttle closed. Fuel off. Mags off. I would open the door. So we're 800 feet. Seven hundred feet. Turning on to final. Six hundred feet. Yeah, I think we make that going around. Copy the victor, port final number one. Okay, and climbing away. Well, that worked out quite well. I was quite pleased with that. We have to recover by 500 feet. We're at sea level here, pretty much. Uh, rule 5 of the rules of the air, the air navigation order, states that um, you must come no closer to any person, vehicle, vessel, building no closer than 500 feet and so that's why I recover there at 500 feet.
we uh, suffered an engine failure. Oh dearie, dearie me. Let's turn downwind. So we're heading westerly. We need to. The wind is from the northwest, so we need to head southeast. Uh, southeast. A little approach. Golf November whiskey. Actually, it's that Tango, same field. Uh, to be honest. Let's say that's downwind. Tango, little approach. Good morning. Pass the message. Golf November we're going to go for that Tango field there, there. No, one, seven, that one there. From North Wheel to the so, uh, uh, what's the problem? Uh, fuel pump uh, on, carb heat on, West change fuel tank, quantities the, are fine, Question no problem with fuel, we'll trying to start, nothing, mixture is rich, exercise throttle, nothing. Mayday, 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 Golf Charlie Echo, India Zulu, PA28, Engine failure at the Romney Marsh, Royal Military Canal, descending through 1,700 feet, intend to make a forced landing. There's one on board and I'm a PPL, my colour is white and blue. I'll warm the engine. It's got a nice undershoot there. Right, let's get our glide speed right. Now we need to do our shut shutdown checks, so uh, fuel off, pump off, uh, mixture is lean, mags are off, fuel uh, throttle closed, open the door, mixture master off. Well, when ready. Got Fox or Tango, traffic you made, is PA28 operating in the vicinity of the Limienk Delta, last supported 2,100 feet. A uh, couple of traffic, keep your lookout, Got Fox Tango. All right, so we're quite high here, just going to go out a bit further. That's our field there, a thousand feet, so we can always go through. Coffin is Zulu Macy, 172 traffic, just past Tenterton, routing towards the lead overhead at 2,500. Oh, Roger, that's understood, just practicing a PFL, uh, so descending to uh, 500 feet. Roger, surface wind at lead, 1209 knots. So we're coming on to final. Whoa. Uh, flaps, two stages, push down, another stage, push down, coming up on 500 feet, okay, going around. Get one away. Away. Off we go. Looking for that traffic. I'm happy with that, actually. That's quite good. Oh, it's a bit buffety here, look. All right, not particularly coordinated, not particularly clever, so I obviously need to practice those a bit more. Thirteen miles distance. Uh, the track is due east, is due west, 270. We need to add a uh, wind correction for west, which is plus four, so it's 274. And the wind speed would be 92. So we're going 30, 13 miles uh, at 19 knots. We'll take nine minutes. Golf India Zulu uh, detail complete, uh, now at Tenterton, 2,300 feet, and we'll be changing back to Farnborough Radar, 123 decimal 225. Golf India Zulu, Roger, that's approved, Scork 7,000, bye-bye. Scork 7,000, thanks for your help, goodbye, Golf India Zulu. So we're at Tenterton, and the time is, start is 11.12. So it's turn on to our course, which was, Track 
274 on the heading. Let's put that on here to remind us. 274. Just want to get over the top of uh, Tenterton before I. So I'm, I'm basically doing a track to Wadhurst here. Coming over Bjorwater now, just looking for anyone doing any practice manoeuvres. Wadhurst is kind of on its own, just on the tip of the uh, lake, with Tunbridge Wells to the north west of it. There we go, there's Wadhurst. So we're a minute early, but we found it. So our next heading is 338. 338. Our time is 2-0. So let's turn around. Hello, Wadhurst. So that's how you do our diversion. So we'll just do the other leg back to Biggin Hill. Well, back to Seven Oaks, actually. Quite murky up here. I've got birds to my left. They're diving. God, you should have seen that bird, that was close. Uh, Gold Petty Zulu, is a glide approach uh, possible, please? Gold Petty Zulu, we're from uh, runway 21, you're clear to land, surface wind 1703 knots. Runway 21, clear to land, Gold Petty Zulu. That goes on, that's on. So let's establish the glide. There you go. Thank you for joining me on this lovely flight where we have done some steep turns, we've done some practice force landings, we've done a glide approach, and we've done two diversions. I'm quite happy with that for a bit of practice. Uh, be sure to comment on the video, particularly if you have any top tips you'd like me to share with my viewers, things that you've learned whilst flying, or if you're not a pilot and you have some burning questions you want to ask me, uh, then get in touch using the comment section on my YouTube channel or via Facebook or through my website. Remember though, I'm not an instructor, and if you have any particularly technical questions, best ask an instructor, but uh, I'll certainly be happy to help you out in general terms. Thanks for watching. 
and make sure you join me for my next video. Bye for now. Thank you.